You kind of asked why why CCS had a checkered history. Well, I mean, you compare it with renewables and people say, well, look where CCS is and look where renewables are. And you go, yeah, but renewables in the UK have had the you know, best part of 10 billion quid a year for the last 30 years thrown at it, right? And CCS, if we were honest, it's an early stage technology. It's working elsewhere, but it's still at the kind of innovation stage. We've got to get some of this stuff in the in the ground. The transition is huge. You know, transforming the economy, the entire econ energy economy to a low carbon system is, is an absolutely massive undertaking. It's much, much cheaper than we thought it was going to be 15 years ago. There's been great progress in technology, but it's st there's still big gaps and we still uh, absolutely have to be making progress on technology across the board and CCS is a crucial part of that because it's a it's a technology which has loads of great system properties it's uh, useful for power and uh, kind of dispatchable power um, it looks potentially really important for industry and heavy industry and how that works but you've got to get that ge geography of that working etc so it's a kind of classic uh, systems technology which everyone feels a bit uncomfortable about because there's no one's quite you know absolute first choice but if you think about how you get the system cost down it's potentially a really important one and the only way you learn about it is you have to deploy these things